HDMN Hong Kong. I'm Chester Chan, and next to me is Minso Key. Today, we will start off by telling the top stories of this week, followed by sports and the weather. It seems that there has been many crimes lately. Yes, I agree. Lately, a criminal has been working overtime. Just a few days ago, the police found out the death of Neil Haywood, a 41-year-old British businessman in the top four terrace apartment near the Bournemouth Seafront in Chongqing. It seems that the top suspect is the wife of a Chinese Chongqing politician named Bo Xi Lai. According to the press, Bo Xi Lai is corrupt. It is said that he arrests wealthy businessmen from his country and accuses them of corruption to get their money. Then they are thrown into jail and in some cases executed. Yes, that is true indeed. It is also said he does this to get better reputation. Okay, one of our reporters, Henry Seeker, is reporting live in Chongqing for a special report. Let's see what he's got for us. Thank you, Chester. I'm making a live report from where it seems Neil Gatewood, a British national, was poisoned. I'm going to ask those officers for more information on the murder of Neil Excuse me, I'm recording a live report here from HCMN. Do you have anything to tell us about the death of Neil Haywood? Neil was sharing a room with Gu Kai Lai, the wife of a Chinese communist politician named Bo Xi Lai. It seems that after Neil Haywood had an economic conflict with her, Neil Haywood made a fatal mistake. It seems Neil Haywood was the one who was keeping Bo Xi Lai's hands clean by hiding where the family's wealth came from. Neil Haywood threatened to release the secrets of the family such as corruption, which is why later that day, Neil Haywood was found dead with no traces of Gu Kai Lai. Wow, that's some, that's some white. You heard it, folks. This is Henry Seeger reporting live from the Bournemouth Seafront. Neil Haywood was then cremated when Bo found out this, about the situation. Further information is still under serious investigation. <laughs> Bo Xi Lai has a huge amount of power, oh, and he is misusing it big time. This seems to be spreading communism. Speaking of communism, North Korea has launched a long-range missile a few days ago. It seems that they launched this missile, but failed. But why did they launch the long-range missile? We have that covered as well. Reporter Rogers Parker is reporting live from where the missile was launched. The North Korean government claims that the, this missile was tied to their 100th anniversary of their former country's leader, <laughs> Kim Il-sung. However, as observers claim it, that the launch was actually tied in with the country's missile program, it seems the real reason they launched the missile was to show the country's power and wealth. Thank you, Rogers. And now we will have a five-minute break. Stay tuned for more exciting news here in HCMN, Hong Kong. <laughs> 